May 5th, 1961, Freedom 7. The United States took the first small step on its journey to the moon. America's first man in space, Alan Shepard, rode the Mercury capsule. Lifted to 116 miles by the Redstone rocket's 78,000 pounds of thrust. Ten years later, the launch vehicle is Saturn V, with a thrust of seven and a half million pounds. On January 31st, 1971, the crew of Apollo 14 would leave Earth on their mission to the moon. The man who began our first decade of manned spaceflight would command the mission that would close that decade, Alan Shepard. With him, Stuart Rusa, who would orbit the moon alone while Shepard and Edgar Mitchell explored its surface. Their destination, a rugged area of lunar highlands called Fra Mauro. February 4th, Apollo 14 went into orbit around the moon. That's really a wild place up here. Okay, there's and, right and there the it is. Right out the right right money. Right out the money. That's beautiful. Right out the window. Just like the window. There's Houston here, Bill Bellini. Cone Crater, okay, okay. a major objective of this out. mission to Fra right, Mauro. Okay. A hole blasted in the moon's surface I'm eons ago. Out that could provide a scientific clue to the history of the moon, the Earth, and the solar system. later, 114 hours, 22 minutes after leaving Earth, Alan Shepard stepped onto the moon. It looks like you're about on the bottom step and on the surface. That's bad for it, old man. Okay, you're right. Alan's on the surface, and it's been a long way, but we're here. Four minutes later, he was joined by Ed Mitchell. Following the tradition of two previous missions, Shepard and Mitchell planted the flag in the lunar soil. Does this look okay? Roger, that's a good sight. 149 hours after they left Earth, they performed the burn that broke them out of lunar orbit. During the coast to Earth, there would be time to catch up on sleep, relax, and do all the little things left undone. On February 9th, 1971, 
Nine days after they left Earth, the crew of Apollo 14 hit the atmosphere of their planet at a speed of over 24,000 miles per hour. They hurtled toward Earth, a meteor heading home. On board, 95 pounds of the moon. Extremely important that relates to the question of why we why we're fooling around with the moon. It's really that the the imprint of history, the solar system history on the Earth-Moon system, is centered on the moon for the first billion years. <laughs> 